Well, their songs certainly are a great part of the American Songbook by Peter, Paul, and Mary. This Land is Your Land, Puff the Magic Dragon, Blown in the Wind. All of them were in my piano lesson, I must say. <laughs> and here to tell us a little bit more about uh, the upcoming performance, we have Rick Lucchese. We also have Patty Smith Lucchese and Trey Warner. Good morning to all of you. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Peter, Paul, and Mary. <laughs> now. That's what you're called. Right. So first, tell us a little bit, remind us, Trey, about some of the music that Peter, Paul, and Mary sang. Well, Puff the Magic Dragon is probably one of the biggest hits because children and adults alike sure. know the song. Um, Leaving on a Jet Plane, which mm -hmm. was a John Denver tune, is real popular. Uh, there's, there's a songbook of Peter, Paul, and Mary music that will blow people away when they come see the show. And for the most part, when people come see us, they know the music unfortunately better than I do. Uh, <laughs> they don't miss a word, they don't miss a beat, they know everything and it's uh, kind of intimidating at first but it's really fun, it's a huge sing-along. So you encourage singing along, that's Absolutely. okay. Yes. Absolutely. Okay. And Patty, tell us a little bit about how you become a tribute artist in studying the mannerisms, mm -hmm. the singing style, how do you do that? Uh, one of the things I did was I watched a lot of videos of Mary Travers, who is the, one of the most amazing singers to me. She is the voice in my head from my childhood in, from the 60s when I would listen to the music of Peter, Paul, and Mary. It just, it would give me goosebumps mm -hmm. when I would hear her voice. And she was such a perfectionist and she, you know, they were very politically active also mm -hmm. and, the, and a lot of the songs that they did were... Um, you know, they talked a lot about politics and things that were happening, you know, during that time. And, you know, you could just see her there with her fist and she would get this look on her face and she would just tell the stories through the song. And so I, I, I studied, I watched how she moved and sometimes she did these freaky, crazy dances because she, she was like me. She's a funny dancer. And, but she, <laughs> you know, she just was just let it all hang out and did her thing and people just love her. And when you, when you um, talk to people about Peter, Paul and Mary, they just, they just love Mary Travers, and it's such an honor to be able to uh, portray her. Well, you certainly have the look down. Thank That's you. for certain. Thank you. And Rick, tell us how in the world they, they're just known for such fabulous harmony. That's right. How do you manage that? What's the secret? Well, the secret is working together real closely. And of course, as she said, studying the videos, mm -hmm. you have to be very, very close, get everything precise. Uh, you know, their music of course came out of the folk era but it took on a flavor of its own I like to think of it as classical music myself in a sense because okay. you have all these harmonies interweaving you have the melodies on the guitar going back and forth and it all comes together in a really nice way it's a lot different than for instance well they took a lot of Bob Dylan songs which uh, in their essence are strummed chords mm -hmm. and just straight singing they took that and built it so that each voice has its own unique flavor and of course the two guitars had to find a, a place too. And you both play guitars too just like they did. That's yes. Right. And do you have any other musicians traveling with you? Uh, we don't have any traveling with us. We tend to pick up bass players in the towns we're playing oh, okay. from the orchestras. Yeah, but it's still, all of it relies on the three of you. Then. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. We're self-sufficient wow. and, and, and self-sustaining. So when we go out <laughs> and play, we can, we can play anywhere at any time and, and pull it off, and it's all the music. Well, they're delighted I didn't ask them to sing first thing in the morning, because it's always <laughs> difficult at 6.30 in the morning. But uh, they will be performing tonight at the Verona uh, Performing Arts Center, which is, of course, located at the high school. It is at 7.30. Get there early to get your tickets and enjoy just a wonderful evening. This is a family performance Absolutely. of songs yes, that every kid should grow up listening to. Yes. That's right. Absolutely. Thanks so much for coming Thank to Thank you for having us. We it's really appreciate pleasure. it. We'll be right back with the Weather Authority forecast after this.